Our next question is, there are two inclined surfaces of equal length L and the same angle of inclination 45 degrees with the horizontal. One of them is rough and the other is perfectly smooth. A given body takes two times as much time to slide down on rough surface than on the smooth surface. The coefficient of kinetic friction mu k between the object and the rough surface is close to. So, two inclined surfaces are there. This is also seems to be uh, having heavy calculations so that the, it will eat uh, your time. So, two inclined surfaces are there. One is rough, so it has some fric uh, friction. So, if you if you put a block there. So, this block will come fastly, but this, this block will not come fastly because of the roughness, because of the frictional force which is opposing. So, if you draw free body diagram, you will come to know the exact picture on exact formulation for the acceleration. For learning for free body diagrams, we will learn about how to calculate the acceleration which is acceleration of the block which is sliding down. So, in this case, it will be acceleration is equal to z sin theta. But here it is, I uh, will put a s here, uh, here a r roughness, a r is equal to z sin theta minus mu z cos theta. Because whatever the acceleration is there earlier when roughness is not there, it is z sin theta. When roughness is there, frictional force opposing it one. So, frictional force is mu k into normal force, where normal force is balanced by g cos theta. So, same thing. So, here we got two accelerations g sin theta and this is g sin theta minus mu g cos theta. If you substitute 45, it will be z by root 2 and this will be z by root 2 minus mu z by root 2 or if you take a common z by root 2 is equal to 1 minus mu k. So, these are the expressions for accelerations. But from the question, it is clear that uh, the sliding times are related like uh, uh, the time of sliding about rough surface is double than the time of sliding on smooth surface. So, we can we can take like a time of uh, sliding for the smooth surface is uh, uh, half of the time of rough surface that is what it is given time of rough surface is double than time of smooth surface. So, it is given like this. So, if I get an e equation based on these two I can easily find mu k. So, we know that the distance travelled by the slide will be same as L only. So, if you get the expression from one dimension, the distance travelled by the block is L which is equal to half into A t square. So, in both cases I can write L is equal to or you can equate both because length is same. So, I can write A t square z by root 2 into t s square is equal to z by root 2 into 1 minus mu k into t p square. So, z by root 2, z by root 2 gets cancelled. So, we need 1 minus mu k which is equal to t s square by t p square. So, you will get 1 by 4 here. So, if you reshuffle it, uh, mu k is equal to 1 minus 1 by 4 which is 3 by 4 which is 0 0.75. So, answer is the first one. First one is the answer. You know these accelerations just by putting the respective formula you will get it easily, but it will take time for the calculations it will take time to visualize the procedure and all uh, it will take time only little bit mid level question mains level question only.